Hi, welcome. It is the Nisha Jackson Show. How are you? I'm Rusty Humphreys. She is Nisha Jackson, and welcome to the program uh, that is growing in leaps and bounds every single week. I don't even know if Nisha realizes how many people are watching and listening every week. If you're one of those people, first of all, thank you. We appreciate it. And uh, also would love for you to please tell your friends and family, uh, subscribe to the show, whether it's on YouTube, Facebook, Roku, uh, Apple TV, Fire TV, uh, the radio station, wherever you're watching, subscribe, uh, tell your friends, and let people know about the program. Um, Nisha, so there's all kind. We're still kind of talking about the coronavirus because that's really all anybody's thinking about right now because everybody's still locked in their houses. How is it where you are? You're in Oregon where they're kind of shutting the state down, right? Yes, uh, actually, you know, I, everybody's feeling this. It's just so I feel so awful for people who are out of work, uh, for business owners who have had to shut their businesses down and don't know how they're going to continue. Um, we're, we're trying to be experts in fields that we've never had to be experts before. It's, it's, I know in my business, it's the same thing. We're trying to master certain things that we didn't think that we would find ourselves having to master right now and reorganizing schedules and, and priorities and our focus and our pre medical practices. It's, it's just, I just, my heart goes out to everybody who's really suffering in, in it's affecting all of us in some, um, minimal or very profound way. And mm -hmm. so I just, I just think about that every day, all day about how awful this is for everyone. Um, and some people much worse than others. How is it affecting so, you? I mean, is it so, so like, uh, patients, are you doing everything by the phone now? Are you still able to let patients come into your office? What is going on right yeah. now? Yeah. So we are seeing, uh, we are doing a lot of televisits, um, we, uh, just diagnosed our first, uh, Corona, um, uh, just had our first coronavirus, uh, virus, positive virus detection via televisit. So I'm glad that patient didn't come wow. in the office. Wow. Um, but anyway, it's, it's just, it's very stressful, uh, because we, 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 we're not used to seeing patients that way. Fortunately, we already had that worked out before this happened. Good. So we just accelerated it. Um, but I think patients really appreciate it. We had one lady that, that did a televisit last week and her three kids were screaming in the background and she's like, this is so great that I get to do a visit over the phone. I don't have to get a babysitter. My kids are screaming. It's like, great. Woo. So I think televisits are, are, are probably going to be something we do more of in the future. Cause it is very convenient. It's very stressful for people to try to take off time from work to come and, and is find it much, a is, child care, et cetera, or is travel. It, is it as, um, efficient. I mean, it's efficient for you, but as a patient, is it as good for me or does it matter? You know, what we're finding, which is really interesting with televisits is that, that the patients seem to actually focus better because they're really looking at you on a screen and they're typing, they're writing things down. It, it, it appears as if they're focusing more, which I think is awesome. That's, that is great. That is, that's awesome. Well, I'm glad things are going, oh, I'm sorry. I'm a little tired. I uh, need a little energy. I just have these things. I don't know if you've heard of them. They're called uh, pickup sticks, Brand X. Have you, yes. have you heard of these things? Yes, those are pretty amazing. Yeah, tell, I have one in. I have one in my water bottle right now. Can you do me a favor before we get started? Because we want to talk a little bit about what you're doing while you're home. But can you tell me a little bit about Brand X? <laughs> okay, so Brand X. Here we go. Brand X. It comes in a little uh, container of 30 like this. Mm -hmm. They're individual packages, which are, um, they look like this. Let me turn it the right side up. <laughs> and uh, they're, they're uh, pickup sticks. You know, it's kind of like the natural rival to five hour energy. That's really what I wanted in a product was something that people could take to instantly pick them up, open up their brain, get them to focus, get them to concentrate without having the negative effects of artificial ingredients and additives. I wanted, I wanted the products to actually be good for people's immune system. I wanted it to be good for their brain. I wanted it to be good for inflammation, pre-workout, post-workout. So we're really selling a lot of these right now. Um, you can see Rusty putting it in the bottle. That's very nice, Rusty. And uh, it, you can actually mix it with anything. I even had somebody tell me they mixed it with champagne. Come uh, I'm, on. Not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not endorsing that. I'm just saying <laughs> it's done. That's what they said. Okay. 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 It, so you anyway, don't want to mix it with like an energy drink. That would probably not be a good idea. <laughs> no, don't mix it with an energy drink. 
Um, I actually put a half a teaspoon of vitamin C. This is our vitamin C powder. Hmm. And so I mix vitamin C with mine and that's an extra immunity boost, which I would highly recommend right now. You the guys main, have that at, at nishajackson.com, right? The vitamin yes. C? Okay. The main ingredient, uh, well, there's several really wonderful ingredients in Brand X, but the, the ingredient that has the most to do with your immune system is quercetin. So it has 500 milligrams per stick of quercetin. And the research shows that up to 1,000 milligrams of quercetin a, quercetin a day significantly increases the immune system and has been shown to be an excellent antiviral. Okay. So you're not saying antiviral. that this is going to uh, cure the uh, coronavirus, but it doesn't hurt. It helps. No, what, what we're trying to accomplish with all of these shows we're doing on the virus and just your immune system in general, we're trying to get your body, body better equipped at dealing with the virus. Uh, dealing with any virus, dealing with any bacteria, d being able to let your immune system, which is like your police force and your CIA, letting your immune system go out there and scavenge all the people that looking a little sketchy, okay? Right. All of those bacteria and viruses, we're looking to try to boost your immune system to allow it to be more powerful, like more police officers, more CIA <laughs> surrounding your entire body that's attacking these viruses and bacteria. And it can be done. We can do this. We can help you do this. So, so, so um, you're saying I, I might come in contact with that virus, but because I'm doing the right things or anybody's doing the right things, we may not, we may be able to fight that virus off before it gets us. Absolutely. I mean, you just have to read reports right now. Why is it that people who are immune compromised, that means that they have already uh, diseases, disorders, um, uh, illnesses that are causing their immune system to be compromised. How is it that those people and people who are elderly, who already have a reduced immune system typically, why are they the sickest? Okay. Right? right? Their immune system is compromised. So if we can do things, which we're going to talk about um, we're going to talk about uh, exercise today and what you can do in your home to exercise, but you can also do supplementation. If you do these things, it will get you into a healthier state so that your body can do its job. So your immune system, like I said, the police force, you know, we increase in numbers to be able to allow your body to fight it off. Or if you do get it, you'll recover. Nice. You will recover. Nice. So that's, that's, that's what I want to just give people today because I think – People are really afraid that they're going to die from this illness, and they don't they, they don't have to. You, you have control over what your body does, and now is the time to get serious about it. And one way to start off again, uh, brand X, and I'm just it, it's very it is it is very good. Uh, not yes, only healthy, take, but it tastes good. And uh, yes, the the website's takebrandx.com. Take brand X. And there's several supplements on the site, but uh, the the energy stick, the pick, it's called pickup sticks is a really good one. So one thing I wanted to talk to people about, because so many people are intentionally self-isolating or they're just trying to be, you know, follow what everybody says you're supposed to do and stay inside. And uh, my worry is, Rusty, that people staying inside just means couch potato time. Uh, yeah. Which means, and, and which means pot potato chips. <laughs> Sugar and tons of toxic TV. That's what that means. I and I gotta admit, I'm I'm one of them and I'm embarrassed and, and I wanna go out and exercise. But there's another edition, another episode of the Royals I've got to catch up on. And <laughs> you know, I mean, how do you get motivated and, and what should we do? Well, the first thing I would say, and I and I, I can only say this from personal experience is I like to use exercise as something that that um, allows me to to schedule my day. So I use exercise as a way to anchor my day. So I get up in the morning. The first thing I do, besides drink a cup of coffee, first thing I do is I plan my exercise. I already know what I'm going to do. I'm either going to meet somebody. I'm going to go out in my garage and get on my Peloton. I'm going to use my tonal machine. I'm I'm uh, but I'm going to do it with my garage door open. I'm going to be either walking outside. I don't, I don't go to gyms. Thank goodness. Cause I guess I couldn't go right now. Um, 
But being outside is so important and getting fresh air is really important. So if you can get outside, it's it's key. And I'm going to talk about that a little bit more in a second. But the main thing with exercise, I believe it's really difficult unless you have a schedule by which this is not possible, is to use exercise as an anchor for your day. So you start out that way. And then it, what it does is your energy's up, your mood's up, your anxiety's down, you feel your blood sugar's more controlled, you've burned more calories because you've exercised hopefully on an empty stomach in the morning, which burns up to 200% more calories. Really? So you have now anchored your day and I'm telling you, it's like magic. It will allow your whole day to go better and be more organized. You'll even think better during the day. You'll find that you process better. You focus better because you've anchored your morning with cardiovascular and hopefully some, some type of, um, weight resistance training to, uh, to exercise your muscles. So that's what I would suggest is the first thing you should do. And I, I think if you're trying to lose body fat, the other thing that you should consider doing, which works really well, I've given this advice for years, is to do daily doubles. Make your make your morning exercise the main exercise that you do, okay. but then consider just like 10 minutes in the evening of going outside and walking the dog hmm. or you know, doing a jump rope in the garage or the driveway. Do, do something for 10 minutes. I have one of those machines that's a vibrator machine that you sit on and it vibrates your whole body which is kind of like one of those mini trampolines. Does that do does that work? Yes. It well I like it because it 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 actually improves your lymphatic system which hello is part of your immune system. So I I think if you have one of those those little mini trampolines or a vibrator machine um, those, the, the, those are really good for your skeletal system, your muscles, your, all of your muscles in your body. It also is excellent for your core cause you're trying to balance why the machine is vibrating. So, so there's other things you can do, but daily doubles are sort of key when it comes to wanting to change your metabolism because the, the reality is, and, and you probably know this from being a runner yourself, Rusty <clears throat> in the past is that when you do the same thing for more than six weeks, your body figures it out. Yeah. So you don't get the HDL, you know, the good cholesterol kick. You don't get the, the increase in HDL after six weeks as much hmm. and your body gets used to it. And then your, 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 your body, your metabolism is so sophisticated that it gets used to it quickly, like six to eight weeks. And if you don't change it up or make it more challenging, mm -hmm. what happens is you're burning less fat. Wow. So, so there's a lot of reasons to exercise. I, you know, I, I, I think it's important to just, um, accentuate the most obvious thing right now is that it's amazing for your immune system. And I'll amazing. tell you what, guys, she is tough. You do not want to go <laughs> hiking with this woman because she will leave you behind. She is <laughs> tough. So, and, uh, and so I'd listen to her. Now, the other thing I've heard, and tell me what you think about this, is for people that have a hard time, okay, I'm going to go to the gym or I'm going to work out and then I don't, is to, when you wake up, put on your exercise clothes first thing in the morning so that, you know what, okay, I'm already dressed for it. All right, I might as well go do it. What do you think of that? I think that's such a good tip, and I'm really glad you brought that up because people getting up and putting on, it's you just need the least number of excuses possible, right? So what happens is what most people do is they get up in the morning, they turn the TV on, or they open their computer, or they look at their phone, and all of a sudden – you know, 75 minutes later, they've, you know, been shopping online, you know, been on 17 people's Facebook and making comments. <laughs> and the problem is, is that you just blew your whole time that you could have been doing something so good for your body. And then what's so crazy is people hate their bodies. It's like, I'm so fat. I don't like the way I look, but then they don't do anything about it. So just reduce the number of excuses that you have by rolling out of bed Maybe, maybe what you should do is meditate for 10 minutes before you pick up your phone, you know, allow your body to relax a little bit, set your intention for the day and then start exercising. And, and I actually don't recommend that you, uh, read emails while you're exercising, that you talk on the phone when you're, I recommend that you just focus on your body and you focus on the intentions for that day. Just get her I, done. Just, just get her just done. Get her done. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get her done. And, you know, a lot of people also don't realize that exercise has so many benefits, but 
just what it does in the area of anxiety and depression is so legit. It's so important for raising your mood, curbing your anxiety, reducing blood sugar. It is an absolute prevention for heart disease, diabetes, dementia, it's it osteoporosis. There's so many benefits from exercise and there's a lot of benefits by just going outside. Right. And I know right now people are paranoid to go outside, but actually most people can go outside and still avoid close contact with other people. I mean, the, the rule is six feet. I mean, that's not that hard to stay six feet away from people outside. I think most people can do it. I think most people aren't doing it, but I think most people can do it. And I also think at the very least, you should be in your house with some windows open when you're exercising to get some fresh oxygenated air. You know, when we stay inside, if you live somewhere that's cold right now and you have that dry heat going, it's really bad for your lungs. Hmm. So humidifying the air, if you can, is really good. Opening the air, opening the windows is really good. Opening up the garage door if you're outside, jump roping or whatever it is that you're doing in the garage. Try to make use of your time in your house to allow it to work for your body and your immune system. Well, and how many times have we all said, I wish I had some extra time that I could go and exercise and just focus on getting healthy, but I can't because I'm working. You know, now now's the time, right? Yeah, exactly. So limit your excuses. So if even even when you can go back to the gym, don't get in that mindset, I don't have an hour and a half, so I'm not going. There's so many things you can do in your home. And even if it's just turning the music on and while you're fixing the kids' lunch and while you're fix, fixing breakfast or whatever you're doing, dancing around the house, I mean, getting your knees, like bring your knees up like when you're dancing around the house and do it for 15 minutes. Do it for eight minutes. I don't care. Maybe, maybe do it for maybe jump rope for 60 seconds and then walk briskly around the perimeter of your house for 30 seconds and keep doing that rotation eight times. Is there you a, know? is there an amount of time, like the minimum, okay, five minutes is okay, 20 minutes. I mean, it used to be 20 minutes was the minimum. If you don't do 20 minutes, it's not even worth it. Where are you at yeah. now with that? Yeah. So, you know, I really like interval training. So a lot of times I'll get on my Peloton bike and I will do interval training. That means like go, you go intense for 30 seconds, 60 seconds, 45 seconds, and then you go into a recovery and then you go intense again. And I love cycling cause I think it's, I, I just feel good when I do it. And, um, but there's other ways to do it. I've done it with a jump rope, you know, where you literally jump, you know, jump for 60 seconds and then you just walk in place, you know, um, not, not intensely walk in place, but kind of gradually walk in place for 30 seconds. And then you do eight or nine of those rotations. Now that would only be less than 15 minutes, but you would get a really good metabolic burn from doing that. And so if you want to get a handle on your mood, you want to get a handle on how your body looks you want to get a handle on your depression, your anxiety, your quality of sleep at night, you have to work your body. You have to do something that gets your body moving and gets the circulation all through your body and your brain so it's not all just right into your pelvis by sitting all day. So get 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 the oxygen going and get the circulation going and, and start doing something. Um, I did want to say, I'm going to hold this up. Uh, you know, you can find exercise plans on... Um, on, we'll, we'll post this, but these are the best, I think, YouTube uh, exercise programs that you can do. Uh, many, Most of them are all free. And um, the sites that you can go to, you can find any exercise plan on any, on, and, and, uh, on any YouTube channel. You can find really good and something that works for you. So, um, you know, or even have a friend do it with you, even if she's not in the same house or he's not in the same house, do it at the same time, challenge each other, text each other, your weight, your measurements, um, there, there's sit-ups, push-ups, lunges. You can use an exercise ball. I was at dinner uh, with my friend, um, uh, uh, Mark and Charlene Phelps last night, and we were talking about using exercise bands and those actually work like bodybuilders travel with exercise bands. That means they actually work. So you can do a full body workout. You can dial up a YouTube channel and figure out how to use exercise bands. I mean, geez, do it while you're watching TV, at least exercise bands while you're watching TV or get your exercise ball in front of the TV and do some crunches and some push-ups on an exercise ball when you're watching 
your show, royalty or royal whatever. The royals, or of course, every, royal. every, everybody's into the Tiger King now. I know the Tiger King's oh. important to you <laughs> on Netflix, but maybe your body should be a little more important too, and I, it, I'm sure it is. So uh, yeah. do yourself a favor. Uh, go to nishajackson.com. We've talked about supplements that are important on other shows. You can go find those shows uh, on this channel or scroll back through uh, Facebook or, or look find us on, uh, on uh, YouTube or wherever you find the show. Scroll back and look for the supplements uh, program. Uh, also, uh, take brandx.com. Take Brand X, very, very important supplement that'll help keep you your energy going and help keep you uh, healthy and uh, wealthy and wise. Oh, that's you should tattoo your face like that, like uh, Post Malone. That would be good. <laughs> you could do that. You could have a Brand X right there. These are just okay, ideas. The, 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 Brand X. <laughs> whoosh. That was part of the original commercial. And then they don't they don't do it anymore. How come that was? Cool. I know we're gonna, we're going to dial that up again. Odell and I we're going to dial up the little take brand X. Yeah, take brand X. You take brand X. <laughs> it's like a some kind of superhero handshake or something. <laughs> All right, we're about to wrap it up. Is there anything else that you want to uh, wrap it up with, there, Nisha? Nope. Just nope. give yourself five minutes. Start with five minutes. If you can't do fifteen, you can't do twenty. Okay, for for Pete's sake, do five. Do five. Just put your shoes on, walk around the block, and then dick, you know, come back, you know, <laughs> duck back into your house. You can do it. You can do Just it. Five minutes. You five can, minutes. You can do it. Oh, ten. Five. All right, five. <laughs> All right. Go to nishajackson.com and check out. Also, takebrandx.com. Uh, we're doing two shows a week through this corona crisis, so uh, make sure you check them out. Again, subscribe. Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, YouTube, Facebook. Uh, Roku, Fire TV, Apple TV, pretty much any device at any time, anywhere in the world, you can watch the Nisha Jackson Show. And please tell your friends. We sure appreciate you. We'll catch you next time. I'm Rusty Humphreys. She is Nisha Jackson. And this is the Nisha Jackson Show. <laughs>